Pinchy, you captured the real me. I mean, that that's beautiful. I could cry. Uh, uh boss, <laughs> yeah, we're here. Oh, all right, listen, you two. I, uh, I got a job for you, Splodge. Actually, it, it's a splatter. <clears throat> and, and Dodge. But I ain't got time to say both names. <clears throat> oh, well. I've come back to find a steam engine. Oh, no, that's easy. <laughs> yeah, they're everywhere. Yeah, you can't miss them. Not the one I want. She escaped me once before. As long as she exists, so do the others. But if she can be destroyed... D destroyed? Did you say destroyed? The word. Like hurt? Yeah, destroyed. Uh, there's one small problem there, boss. Yeah, Mr. Conductor's coming, and he won't let you destroy. Uh, he won't let you. No. I can do whatever I want. I'll get him, too. <laughs> With Pinchy. <laughs> yeah. oh. No, Pinchy! I hate it when you do that. <laughs> Well, hello, Mr. Conductor. Oh, hello, Billy. <laughs> Toolkit, check. Ticket puncher, check, check. Aye, 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 aye. All aboard! Just testing, Billy. Mustn't let my conducting skills get rusty. Important day, Mr. C. Oh, it is a very important day. I'm going to the island of Soda. You know, it's the only place in my universe where I really fit in size-wise. Sir Topham Hatt has given me a big responsibility. Diesel 10 is back, and I have to make sure that he behaves himself. Excuse me, Billy. I hope your visit goes well, Mr. C. Thank you, Billy. <clears throat> I must be responsible, reliable, and... Don't tell me. Really useful. I knew that. I'm sorry. What did you say? Oh, well, thank you, Moby Dick. I like my sparkle, too. You know, gold really is your color. Stacy, where did you find this painting? In an old locker. It was done by Burnett Stone when he was a child. I was told that he used to work on this railroad. But he never leaves the other side of the mountain now. You seem puzzled, Mr. Conductor. Well, I am puzzled. This place looks like the island of Sodor, but how would Burnett Stone travel there without gold dust? Sparkle's been the only way to make the trip since the lost engine disappeared. Anyway... I just came to say goodbye. I have to go now. Right now? Why, yes, Stacy. I have to make sure that everything is safe and sound on the island of Sodor, just as I try to do here. Like Stacy, Mutt sensed danger. He didn't want either Billy or me to leave Shining Time. <laughs> Old Smokey, you stay right here until I get back. Ah, there you are. Is something wrong here? <laughs> now, what kind of an answer is that? Ah, I'm going to be late. I'll get back as fast as I can. I have to concentrate now, Mutt. I'm suddenly having problems with my sparkle. <laughs> Mutt. <laughs> Goodbye, Mutt. Sparkle, sparkle, sparkle. Mr. Conductor, where are you? I know you live far away, but you always seem to get here on time. Oh, Mr. Conductor, are you all right? Yes, Thomas, but sometimes everything happens at once. I have to see Sir Topham Hatt to get my orders right away. Journey from Shining Time keeps getting bumpier and bumpier. Does it? A big bully diesel is back, Mr. Conductor. You had better be careful. Sir Topham had warned me about diesel. Don't worry, Thomas. I'll just pop in and out with my sparkle wherever he goes and keep him in order. I hope. Old McDiesel had a plan. <laughs> with a 
pinch, pinch here, and a pinch, pinch there, here a pinch, there a pinch. <laughs> I crack myself up. Tasha, the Conductor family has a little steam engine, their own railroad, that has wonderful energy because of her. But a diesel wants to destroy her, and without her, the Conductor's universe will vanish. The man with the sparkle told me one day, one of his family would return. But until then, to guard her well, young Burnett. But I didn't guard you well. I just don't seem to understand about about magic anymore. 